Hey guys, Mike Minor here. It's been a while that I haven't uploaded video because I'm preoccupied with some projects and then ongoing projects which I need to deliver. This one is just a quick update regarding how you can be able to withdraw your your crypto coming from your Binance going to to other exchanges because as you can see in my backdraft when I was trying to convert my SLP to USDT it says here dear user as per our terms of use and compliance with local regulations these features are not available in your region please register for an account with Binance SG to access further features so that means they they already uh, block the trading for Singapore as of October 26 which uh, as, as they mentioned really they got a one month notice in order for you to, to transfer over to, to other exchanges or for you be for you to be able to withdraw your your crypto or your USDT they actually blocked the ERC 20 uh, on, on the network where you're not able to to withdraw or trade anymore so the purpose of this video is i'm going to share with you how you can be able to withdraw coming from your binance going to other exchanges the reason why i'm still using binance is because currently i have some uh, xe or i have some scholars to where i'm withdrawing from ronin and then ronin uh, going to binance is free of charge in transferring in withdrawing so that's why I'm still using Binance so that's the reason why you can be able to use because if you're gonna transfer to other exchanges most probably you will be charged a very high gas fees so that's the main reason why I still use the Binance so the first step here that you need to do is you go to more services on the home page of the uh, Binance and then you click convert then you will be going to this page then you select your coin where you're going to convert so I select my SLP and then I select uh, LTC. So I search LTC because LTC is the lowest uh, gas fee or the charges that when they try to transfer to other exchange. So and then I try to click max convert. As soon as you click convert, it will say conversion successful. Once you converted ready to your your coin to LTC coin right now is in uh, my coin right now is in our gate IO so I'm, I'm storing all my USDT currently in uh, uh, gate IO I'm going to convert my LTC in gate IO and then I'm gonna store there for a while and then until such time I'm ready for withdrawal what I'm going to do is I'm going to transfer it over to uh, uh, crypto.com and then uh, crypto.com as I mentioned in my previous video to be able to withdraw your crypto coin in uh, crypto.com going to your local bank as I mentioned in my previous video so now I'm gonna share with you how you can be able to, to transfer over your LTC coming from Binance going to Gate.io so I search my my LTC or the coin LTC and then currently is generating my uh, wallet so I just have to get my wallet or from uh, gate io and then copy over to binance so this one will take some time it will take about three minutes to to render or to generate and then uh, we can copy over as soon as it generates uh, we are going to copy over our wallet copy our wallet address gate io wallet address to binance and then we try to withdraw whatever we have converted in which is the ltc so we click withdraw and then uh, copy over our address here and then uh, it automatically detects the Litecoin and then as you can see the charge here is very minimal it's only 0 0.001 then uh, I cannot be able to share my screen at the moment because when you try to withdraw I think the Binance is blocking the screen capture when you try to record because uh, I just recorded this yesterday so when you try to, to withdraw there's three security that you need to fill in which is your mobile number in there security code through your email 
and then you need to authenticate using uh, Google Authentication. So as soon as you have authenticated, you just uh, the request has been submitted successfully. So you just have to wait, and then uh, it will transfer over to your Gate.io. Now I receive a push notification saying coming from Binance saying that my withdrawal is successful. And then what I'm going to do, I'm going to check Gate.io if my withdrawal has already appeared. And then uh, I go to my wallet, and then Spot Account. I'm gonna check. It seems it will take some time. Normally, an LTC would take about 15 minutes, 15 to 20 minutes uh, in transferring. So we'll just have to wait. So let's try to check one more time if uh, it already goes in. It took about more than uh, 15 minutes now. So I'm checking. So it already go through. My balance now it's uh, 1553 and it's uh, 267. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to trade my LTC to USDT. Gate.io is not blocking uh, Singapore uh, trade inside so it's very easy to convert here and then you sell once you sell it will prompt you for your pin number and then uh, and then once you key your pin number or submit and then it will be completed successfully processed where your LTC is already converted to USDT so it's a short video only guys just to share with you how you can trade your existing coin going to other exchanges easily where uh, what happened to me actually from Binance going to Gate.io and then I trade uh, my crypto coin to USDT in uh, or Gate.io. Later on, I'm going when I'm ready to withdraw, I'm going to convert this to LTC, which I'm going to buy. It's either I'm gonna buy LTC or XRP, and then I'm gonna transfer to my crypto.com and and I'm gonna withdraw from there, or I'm going to sell my LTC from there. The way I'm doing it's because uh, the price of LTC or the price of XRP is fluctuating, so you need to be very quick in trying to sell your LTC to minimize the charges. Something like it will be a charge equivalent to your charges in the exchange, and then that's why you need to do it very quick. As soon as you sell, you try to, to withdraw going to your ex first. Uh, withdrawing from crypto.com, I already explained on my previous video. And then the purpose of this is just a quick update on how you can withdraw from Binance going to your Gate.io. And then uh, that's all guys. And then uh, thanks for watching. Please do subscribe. Try to comment out and to like this video for more updates, for more upcoming uh, contents that I'm going to share, which is uh, really uh, is really helpful that uh, it will help you on trading. Thanks for watching, guys, and God bless.